Hey guys, it's Natalia and welcome to my apartment tour. I decided to finally film an apartment tour because I am moving out of this place at the end of August because I'm going back home to England in September. There will be a video on why I decided not to finish my second contract with my current school, but yeah, I'm not gonna get into that here. So I live in Daegu, South Korea, and I've lived in this apartment ever since I arrived in Korea in February 2023. So I've lived here for over a year, and it's a really nice apartment. In my first year, I lived here with a housemate, and it was great. We became very good friends, so I'm really glad that my first housemate was my housemate because we just got on very well. But yeah, this apartment is the biggest apartment that my school offers to teachers. But of course, you could say the downside is, because most people come to Korea to live by themselves, is that you're probably living with another person. I made a deal where I was supposed to have this apartment all to myself but things happened i'm not finishing my contract so yeah if you have any questions about this apartment i cannot tell you about like how much rent would be on a place like this because i have no idea the only utility bills i actually pay are electricity and gas So that's all I can tell you about my utility bills. I don't pay for water. Again, leave any questions that you have down below. I will try and answer them. I live in the Susong area because that's where my academy is located. I live like in a really nice neighborhood even though it's the furthest to walk i walk for like 20 minutes to get to work which sucks in the summertime but i have like sinchon river very close to me so i love it i'm gonna miss it and there's also like a downtown in daegu and it's within walking distance for me like 20 to 30 minute walk so I miss living in a walkable distance to all these amazing places. So this was a very long intro to my apartment tour, but I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into the apartment tour. So guys, this is the entrance. This is my door. I had to ask for this lock from my manager, but I have this lock. This is the entrance. I kind of came in because I was taking out the trash. But yeah, I have a big entrance. There's like sensor lights and then we have these two shoe cabinets. So in my first year, I had a housemate, but now I live here by myself. So this was my shoe closet originally, but now I have everything kind of organized. Yeah, I like this, that there's an umbrella section. And I just keep random stuff. Like winter hats. I use Pudarak chicken takeaway bags for shoe bags because they're really nice. I have a raincoat from Jeju, but yeah, one shoe closet. Let's go over this quickly. Then second shoe closet used to be my housemates, but now it's kind of my Converse and boots closet. Yeah, this one's a little bit different, the layout. So we have these sliding doors here, but usually keep it open and then you're in the common area the living room kitchen dining area so we have on this side there is a door to my room this has always been my room so i'll show you that in a minute here we have a coat rack i keep my bags so i have like this cover net bag a scarf i have shopping bags and then all my jackets and coats are on here and then I have more bags here. So yeah, this is what the entrance looks like from far away. We do have a big window there, but it's always like the blinds are always closed because the neighbors could see inside. But we have another big window here. There's a TV, which is really nice. I used to keep my workout stuff in my room, but now I only work out in the living room because I work out from videos on my laptop, but I'm always watching. Now it's Glee, it used to be more than family when I'm working out. So yeah, pretty much all that stuff, well this stuff is from Daiso. I brought the band with me and then weights are from Coupon. This is the second room, my housemate's room, but I actually keep it as storage. 
so I rarely walk in here I just keep the door open to air it out but I have extra bedding and then I have that mattress thing but this is what her room looked like there's a mirror here there's a little hallway and then her bathroom was smaller than mine because she has an ensuite and what was nice she had a little like wardrobe in here let's go back into here so i used to have this bookshelf in my room but ever since my housemate moved out and i've been living by myself here i moved in here because it looked very empty i have a vacuum cleaner here and then this is my bookcase I really like it. My biggest purchase and my best purchase in Korea was Gentle Monster sunglasses. I have this like little doll from Japan and a wooden postcard from Japan. The Niffler is from back home. I have a card that I got from my friend. Here are my photo cards from albums. Like this is really cute, this packaging. I have a soju glass. I brought this crystal, rose quartz crystal from home, but it's going back home with me. I have wedding invite. I was lucky enough to go to two Korean weddings in my time here, so that's nice. I have this caricature of me from Seoul. I have one of my favorite books, Bride. I have this little teddy that I got from my friend. This little guy is from Hong Kong. I have posters back here because I used to have posters on my wall but ever since deciding to move back home I took everything down from the walls. I have a card from one of my students. This is from my students. I keep two boxes here. I keep letters from my students here too and like letters from anyone that I got. I have some books. I bought a lot of books here. Most of them are going back home with me. Then I have K-pop albums and I have Buttercup and my little Minnie Mouse ears from Disneyland Hong Kong. And then we have just random stuff here. I actually yesterday bought a photo booth little album. So that's really nice. And then I keep more postcards that I used to have up on the wall there. And then yeah, just random stuff. That's just a bag of beauty products I want to give away to my friends because I don't use them. Here are the fridges. So yes, what was nice when I had a housemate we had our own fridges, but this is my fridge. Again, I had to put all this up, so I put up my favorite postcards and my favorite photo booth pictures, but my fridge is literally nothing special. Frozen fruit, frozen mandu, and frozen vegetables. And then it's very sad in here. A lot of tofu, eggs, sheet masks, a smoothie for breakfast, and then zucchini and oat milk. Clearly, I haven't done the weekly shop. Then here, we move on to the kitchen. So we have the dining room table here. You can sit comfortably and watch TV from here. So I have a lot of stuff on here. I have this little dish where I keep random stuff. I have remote for TV and remote for air conditioner. Then we have this really pretty plant that I bought last July. It used to be very bushy, but it lost a lot of leaves because of the humidity. I have a fan here. I have Phoenix tissues because I'm a little sick. A lint roller and this spray that I got. I actually don't recommend it. It's like a toner or serum spray. I only got it because Min Yoon Gi did an advert with them on his talk show, but yeah. Here is the little trash corner. I have recycling, plastics, and general, and then that's food waste. Then we have the little window from the kitchen. That is my view. I have a hospital right in front of me and I think that is, it's a middle school and a high school put together. But I have, I bought so many bouquets of flowers and I didn't want to trash all of them so I dried my favorite ones. That is it. I have a little spray bottle for my plants. This plant looks so nice last month but this month, as soon as monsoon season started, it died. So I'm so sad because I got it for my birthday. Then I have this little stand. It has the microwave, bin bags, and we have a blender that I got for my birthday. And then I have a kettle, and then I have drip bag coffee behind. I really like my kitchen because of the counter space. I'm not going to show you what's inside because it's not very interesting, 
but we have some bananas. This is my favorite cabinet that I will show you. It's my tea and coffee, even though I actually think there's no coffee here left. Here we have just a lot of utensils, oil, and yeah, my matcha making tea set, more utensils. I love this drying rack because it's so nice to have this space and this space because sometimes I have a lot of dishes at the end of the day and yeah that is the kitchen dining living area so here let's go down this hallway so let me turn on the lights for this room this is technically like a storage room so I have a lot of stuff there is a door back there for the rooftop but I have no access which is really sad I wish I did I think living here would be so much more fun with a rooftop and then you turn there's a window with laundry stuff so we have a washing machine here this washing machine is quite nice because it has a dryer option and i never thought i would use a dryer but because of the humidity especially in the summer you have to use the dryer because the drying rack does not help i have a mop duster and another vacuum cleaner that doesn't really work that well we have my bathroom i really love my bathroom i wish the shower was closed i hate washrooms but it's really big like there's a toilet here the sink area i have a lot of space here for beauty products i don't think there's that many because as i said i'm moving back home so i'm trying to use up most of it but I really like that there's so many mirrors and so much storage in here. I bought the bath towels from home because in Korea they don't have good towels. But yeah, this is my shower. I used to actually have two of these. There was one hanging here, but literally it broke a week or two weeks ago. And yeah, that is all the beauty products I have in my shower okay let's leave the bathroom and go to my room the last room of this tour so my bedroom as i said is next to the entrance so let's walk in it's nothing special i feel like it looks very plain ever since i took everything down from the walls but it's okay so as you walk in you see my bed straight away there is a floor lamp from ikea i don't have a bedside table i was planning on getting one but i always keep everything here so sometimes you'll hear banging from my room and that's probably because all that stuff fell down but that is just the book I'm currently reading and my iPad. Then I have a little laundry basket. Then we have a dresser as I don't have a wardrobe here, which really sucks. But I'll show you what I decided to do for my hanging clothing. But yeah, on the bottom, I keep trousers, shorts and skirts. Here I keep going out tops. Here is everything that I would wear as loungewear. So at home, here it's socks and like bikinis and stuff and at the top i keep bras and underwear and then at the top i have this incense holder i have my yungi poster that i got from his concert and an army bomb yes i have two now because my old one is back at home i have this thank you teacher i love you from last year's kids for teacher's day i have little timmy there Maria Huasa album and Imnayon album. I love this album. Then I have this little guy that I got from a friend from my paralegal job. So, and then I have flowers that I got again for Teacher's Day from that big one is from a student last year and this one is from a student this year. Then we have my book case. At the bottom, I have things that I'm taking home. Then I have like laptop protector. I have, this is like my technology section. Here I have a lot of baseball caps. Like the guys here, I became a baseball cap lover because Koreans stare at you less when they cannot see your face. So I keep my sunglasses here. Then I have my beauty section. So nail stuff, makeup, deodorant, and aloe vera, which I use as body cream. I have my little more nail section. 
this cute box that I got from a co-worker for jewelry. I have a little first aid kit. Then we have some albums. So we have We An Album. Then we have Pentagon Positive. We have BTS. I have Ari by Ariana Grande perfume. I'm a very big lover of Marc Jacobs perfume. So we have Daisy and Daisy Oh So Fresh. Then we have Delight album by Baekhyun. And then we have Peaches by Kai album. We have my Coco Mademoiselle Chanel perfume. I I've had that perfume since I got it for one of my birthdays. It's been a couple years. This is a cute turtle that I got from a student that went to Vietnam last year for her summer vacation. And I actually found out after my cousin came that this is a tape measurer. I have this cute little cat from Hong Kong. And then we have the Wave album by CIX. I know it's not called Wave, but the main single is Wave. And then Don't Call Me by Shiny. At the top, I just have a box for my hair curler. I have a little lint remover and then an extra towel. At the top there, I have an iron and travel bags. And then I forgot about this corner. I have a journal another journal my cat taros this houses all my stickers for my journal then next to my bookcase i have a mirror this is where i check my outfits before i leave and then this is what i thought of doing instead of getting a wardrobe just a clothing rack i recommend the one for i think this one was twelve thousand from coupon don't buy the daiso one because that's plastic this one is metal and it's so sturdy and it's so much bigger so i have more bags i've noticed i'm a bag hoarder and then at the bottom here i have like extra clothing and then i have a iron board and then a hot water bottle and yeah i think that's it actually i forgot my desk area so i used to have i'll put in a picture if i find one i'm pretty sure i have one i used to have so many pictures here and it made like my desk area so pretty but i took it it all down so my desk is quite big i just wish it had storage because it's so much wasted space underneath but i have a rolling wand that i got in england my mom sent to me this is the best purchase ever this astronaut light it was like 20 thousand on coupon i love this i have a little mushroom light from ikea behind it i have this heat protectant spray from england my little laptop area i have a bt21 mouse and keyboard i literally got koya and mang because i wanted this vibe i thought about like orangey vibe but i'm like blue and purple is my vibe i have this little mirror that i got from daiso that i can do my makeup in here i have some makeup brushes i have hand cream that spray again mints best purchase my apple headphones and then some journals this is like my reflection journal so i just write my thoughts and this is my planner and then i have this cute little tissue box okay guys i hope you enjoyed my apartment tour i will miss living in this place it, it was really lovely to have such a big space but it is time to move on and of course i will leave a link link to the video where I say why I'm leaving Korea in the down bar if it already came out but if it hasn't come out yet you have that to look forward to but I missed you guys a lot so I'm really glad to be back on YouTube and yeah I'll see you in my next video bye guys